suffer from trafficking to the point of being threatened with extinction if nothing is done about it. Despite their protection, these animals are still being trafficked. Ignorance of the law is no excuse, so those who violate the wildlife law risk being arrested. Only last month in Yaoundé, three traffickers were arrested. The first one caught in the Manandebo wood by the National Brigade in the Ministry of Forestry and Wildlife. The second, an ivory trafficker, was arrested in the Briketary neighborhood. The third was a lady who was caught trying to sell the skull of a gorilla and other parts of the animal. The arrests were carried out with the assistance of the 10th Police District, LAGA, which stands for the Last Grip Ape Organization, provided technical assistance. LAGA's main mission is to reinforce the respect of wildlife law and to ensure that violation of the law does not go unpunished. According to the law, anyone found in possession of any part of a protected species is considered to have captured or killed the animal and is liable to a prison term of three years or to pay a fine of up to 10 million francs. Experts say if the illegal trade in protected species continues, then these animals are likely to become extinct by the end of this decade.